What's up, vapers? My name is Rione, and I'm here to do your review on the Simple Mod and the Velocity RDA clones. And it is in zombie black and white, <laughs> black and red splatter. Oh my god, it's messed up. Anyway, um, this is a really neat mod. It's so simple, like literally in the name. All you gotta do, all you have is a tube and then the RDA and the spring. Um, so the only thing I don't like about this so far is that this switch it gets jammed a lot like so far since I've been playing with it it's been like it's, it's hard to push in sometimes and you gotta mash it in on the way um, I feel like maybe there's like a lock mechanism but it's saying it doesn't maybe if you like twist it all the way it won't move I believe that's what it is yeah if you like tighten it all the way you can't mash it in but if you just kind of twist it back the other way and then you're back Doing this. Pretty easy. So I'll show you um the inside. So let's unscrew this real quick. I bought this off of eBay. Um, you can find a bunch of these on eBay for real cheap. I bought this for twenty four dollars. I originally almost bought this on Fast Tech for twenty. Um, if you would like to wait about a good week or two, or almost maybe a month, then maybe that's your place. If you like cheap and slow <laughs> and um yeah but i just bought this off of ebay i literally just waited two three days and i got it so here's my battery batteries are obviously not included um buy off of that ebay too so here's the mod literally just a tube oh my god so simple and here's the RDA, the Velocity, and I love the Velocity compared to um, my Hellboy. It's only got two posts, and I'll show you why in a minute. So, this is how you put it back in. Make sure it sends that way. Twist it back in. Just put your hands this way first. And then tighten the sucker up with a coin. Not too tight. So right now I'm vaping on a 0.4, roughly 0.35 to 0.4, depending how good I really wrapped it. But it's about 10 wraps, 12 technically on each side for my dual coil coils. Ooh, I can't talk. And um, because you know you don't count the ones that you connect to the post. And um, it hits pretty good so far. Um, I don't know. I just love it. It's just so freaking tiny and it's so cute. <laughs> so let's just juice this up one more time. There we go. Oh, and right now I am vaping on Cutwood Unicorn Milk. It is so good. It's so expensive though. I probably spent at the mall $25. Oh my god, it was just <laughs> real expensive, but it's so good. Um, I suggest getting it. I would just at least try it just once. Just if you ever want to try any premiums, I would just try Cutwood. Really good. They're based off of California, which I'm from. Ha <laughs> ha. So, get the sucker in. Oh, the air holes are pretty simple too. I mean, look at that. It's just pretty unique. I like that. And look, he's got a little face. Ha, <laughs> faces. <laughs> um, but let's just do one there. Ooh, it's a good hit. Um, if I compare this with my iTaste MVP Pro, MVP Pro, I really can't talk today. Look how small that is. It's really small, and my hands are really small. I'm I'm like a five foot Asian, so that's really nice in the hand. And the way that it feels, it's like grippy, kind of matte feel, like rubbery almost. I don't know what kind of paint they use, but it's really nice. So um. If you're planning on getting it, I suggest you get this. It is so good. I love it. Um, it comes in, it just comes obviously with the stuff, and then it comes with a little screw thing. You actually need like a little wrench or whatever that it comes with. Uh, the Allen key. Yeah, it comes with its own Allen key. And see on the sides, a little post. So it's amazing. I usually vape it like this. This is a 0.3 right now. So. I mean, they vape pretty good, you know. Here's this again. Oh, 
and compared to my high tees. Obviously, this is going to be a little bit more better. <laughs> I just, yeah. Anyway, so if you really like it, I suggest you try it. Um, I, I suggest that beginners don't use this, like, because you, you got to fool around with Ohm's Law. And it's just a big pain in the ass. If you really want to start off, you just get this. Just get one that's regulated. This is unregulated. This is regulated. It tells you tells you all the stuff in there and then you can change how many watts you want to vape on like right now I'm vaping on 40 oh, yeah I like cool vapes and I'm not really sure what this vapes on <laughs> so that's why it's unregulated so you just got to be careful you don't blow yourself up do not use tanks on these you definitely blow your face up I mean I'm just telling you so um if you like this video Click like, comment on it, tell me how I did. This is like literally my first video on anything in forever. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you later.